Yo! What is going on, guys? In today's video, we are going to be talking about what your Fortnite pickaxe says about you. This video isn't in any kind of order, and I just tried to cover a lot of different popular pickaxes in the game, and I'm really interested to see what you guys think of this list. Before we get into it, guys, if you haven't already, make sure to go down and hit that subscribe button. YouTube is telling me that 85% of you guys watching this video right now are not subscribed, so make sure you do go down and hit that button and help us reach that 200,000 subscriber goal. Remember as well guys to go down and smack that like button. Let's try and reach 3,000 likes on this video and finally guys comment your favorite pickaxe in the game. But that's enough talking, let's get straight into the video. Starting us off in the number 19 position, we have Michonne's Katana. If you use this pickaxe, then you love all of the collabs that Fortnite has done during Season 4 and Season 5, and you definitely cannot wait to see what collabs come to Fortnite in Season 6. You probably own all of the Marvel items in the game as well. You probably actually own every collab item that has ever been added to the game. Even though I did mention Michonne's Katana, you do probably swap this around a lot for stuff like the Sword of the Daywalker, the Combat Knives, and even the awesome Ray's Quarterstaff pickaxe that came with the Star Wars crossover. Moving on to the number 18 position, we have the Crowbar. If you guys use the Crowbar, then you love all of the free rewards that Fortnite gives us. Even though we do get free items pretty much every single Christmas, you always resort to using the Crowbar because it is the sweatiest free item in the game. It also is never going to return, so it is kind of pretty rare as well. You probably don't spend too much money on skins either, and you just use all the free V-Bucks that you do get on either buying the Battle Pass or your favorite tryhard skin. Other than that, you really don't have too many other items. You obviously do have all of the free items that Fortnite gives you, but apart from that, you probably don't own too many skins. Moving on to the number 17 position, we have the Astrolo Master's Axe. If you use this and you don't really care about what skins or pick Axes look tryhard or sweaty, but you just buy what you think looks cool. There are so many people like this in Fortnite, and honestly, I feel like these are some of the best players in the game. They don't take it too seriously, they just enjoy playing the game. It doesn't matter what skins they are wearing, what combos they use, as long as they think they look good, then that is all that matters. Even though I did put the Astrolo Masters axe in at this position, I'm really interested to know what pickaxes you guys think look amazing and isn't tryhard. So if you guys do use some pickaxes like this, make sure to let me know in the comments down below. Moving on to the number 16 position, guys, we have the Reaper. If you guys use the Reaper pickaxe, then you definitely miss the early days of Fortnite back in the early seasons of Chapter 1 when no one really knew how to build, aim, or even loot properly in Fortnite. You might not have bought this pickaxe back in the day when it was first added to the store, but you definitely would have been playing during those early days of Fortnite and remember how tryhard this pickaxe was. This was so, so sweaty. One of the first ever tryhard pickaxes in the game. And I just remember the sound of this pickaxe. People were literally scared to fight against people that were using this pickaxe. It was so intimidating, so insane. And I just really miss the days when this was the most popular pickaxe in Fortnite. Coming in at the number 15 position, guys, we have the Merry Mint. If you guys use the Merry Mint, then you are definitely a sweaty player that likes using rare items in Fortnite. You love this pickaxe especially because even though it is a rare and exclusive item, you could literally buy this pickaxe for $10. That means you get the exclusive sweaty look that you guys really, really want without having to spend hundreds of dollars on those extremely rare items like the Galaxy skin, the Stellar Axe, and other items like the brand new Wildcat skin. This is a really good option, and unfortunately, if you don't own the Merry Mint pickaxe, you will never be able to get it again. Moving on to the number 14 position, guys, we have the driver. If you guys use the driver, then you are definitely a fan of the more simplistic designs in Fortnite. This is still a very sweaty pickaxe, and you are probably one of the best players on your friends list, but you don't go out of your way to buy pickaxes that are very bright, or even skins 
skins that are very colorful either. These players probably main skins like Aura, Manic, and Crystal as well, and they probably don't actually own that many cosmetics in Fortnite. They like using the driver a lot because regardless of what skin you use, the driver is going to work perfectly with it and give you that really sweaty look that you guys are going for. Because of its simplistic design, there really aren't too many pickaxes that are better than the driver, and this is also very similar to other pickaxes like the Icebreaker as well. Coming in at the number 13 position, we have the brand new Skelly Fish Pickaxe. This is the brand new Fortnite Crew Pickaxe for April, and obviously, this hasn't actually been released yet, so you'll see a lot of these Fortnite Crew players using the Puffcorn Pickaxe from the March Fortnite Crew set. These players don't spend too much money on Fortnite and tend to save their money to purchase the Fortnite Crew Packs each month. This is a pretty cool deal considering they get an amazing combo of items, a thousand free V-Bucks and the Battle Pass for only $10 a month. It really does seem like a bargain to me and even though these items aren't as tryhard as some of the other ones that you do get in the item shop, they are still some of the best looking cosmetics we have and definitely worth the $10 price. Moving forward to the number 12 position, we have the Diamond Jack. This is a really underrated pickaxe, and the people that use the Diamond Jack are fans of all of the icon crossovers in Fortnite, and their favorite event by far was the Astro World concert. These players had to buy the Travis Scott bundle as soon as it appeared in the item shop, and you probably still use all of these items today. Your main combo definitely consists of the Travis Scott skin with the Cactus Jack back bling, the Diamond Jack pickaxe with the goosebumps wrap on all of your guns and of course the astro cyclone glider this is a really amazing combo and the fact that travis scott has only appeared in the item shop once actually means that this pickaxe is pretty rare as well i know that i did buy the skin but when the pickaxe does return to the store i'm definitely going to be picking it up moving forward to the number 11 position we have the raiders revenge if you guys use the raiders revenge then you are definitely a locker flex you not only own some of the best skins and pickaxes in Fortnite, but also some of the rarest ones as well. Your Fortnite locker is easily worth at least $10,000, and you probably main the Purple Skull Trooper with the Raider's Revenge pickaxe. You always have the sweatiest and most rarest combo going at the same time, and you never really use any Battle Pass items because you really want to show off how awesome these pickaxes and skins are. You don't see too many of these people anymore. Unfortunately, these items are just that rare that you never really see anyone using it. Coming in at the number 10 position, we have the Candy Axe. If you guys use the Candy Axe, then you are one of two different types of players. The first one means that you are an OG and a sweat, and you love this pickaxe and have owned it pretty much ever since it did come to the store. You love using this because of how tryhard it looks, and of course, how well it goes with every single skin in the game. Even if you didn't buy the Candy Axe in the first season and you did pick it up when it did return to the store, you definitely use it because you know it is a sweaty pickaxe as well. But the second type of player means that you just love all of the holiday cosmetics in Fortnite. This isn't limited to just Christmas but also Easter, Halloween and every other holiday that Fortnite celebrates. You probably use all of the Christmas and Halloween skins all year round and you love using the candy axe because it is probably the best Christmas pickaxe we have ever received. Hopefully we do get some more amazing ones in the future, but this is definitely one of my favorite ones in the game. Coming in at the number nine position, we have the trusty number two and the ACDC pickaxe. If you guys use these pickaxes, then you are definitely a battle pass OG. You want people to know that you've been playing Fortnite since the very beginning, and you didn't really spend money on OG items like the Raiders Revenge, but you did in fact buy the very first battle passes. These are such a huge flex. They aren't really try hard anymore, but if you guys did play during the early days of Fortnite, then these were some of the most try-hard items in the game. You still use them because you want everyone to know that you are an OG, and you probably still use the Black Knight skin every single day. Unfortunately, like the Raiders Revenge players, these are very, very rare, and you hardly see anyone using these items anymore. Moving on to the number 8 position, guys, we have the Star Wand Pickaxe. This is actually one of the more difficult ones on the list because it is so 
so popular. It appeals to pretty much every single type of player in Fortnite, whether you are a pro, a sweat, or even just a casual player. More often than not, you probably have used the style wand at some point in your Fortnite career. More often than not though, if you do use the style wand, then you are definitely going to be a sweaty player. There are still a lot of casual players out there that do use this pickaxe, and that is why it doesn't really matter whether you are grinding out arena, doing box fighting, playing in cash cups, or even just grinding normal games, you will see at least 10 people in the lobby having the style one pickaxe on their combo. It is so worth it, and for only 800 V-Bucks guys, I highly recommend you do pick it up. Coming in at the number 7 position, we have the Axe of Champions. We all know that if you own this pickaxe, then you are one of the best Fortnite players in the world. More often than not, you have at least a $10,000 setup, you have a lot of Fortnite earnings, and you probably play on zero ping as well. This is one of the rarest pickaxes in Fortnite. There are only around 50 people in the whole world that have actually used this pickaxe before, which is so, so crazy, and definitely what makes it so sweaty as well. Coming in at the number 6 position, we have the Stellar Axe. If you guys use the Stellar Axe, then you're definitely a locker collector. You probably own a lot of skins and pickaxes in Fortnite as well, and that isn't just item shop pickaxes, that is also going to be the rare and exclusive ones as well. It doesn't matter how much you have to spend in order to get these rarest items, because the Stellar Axe had a price tag of over $1,000 and is very, very rare. These players love to flex all the the amazing items in their locker, they probably don't use the Stellar Axe for too long and just kind of cycle through all of the rare items that they own. Moving forward to the number 5 position guys, we have the Leviathan Axe. People that use the Leviathan Axe are going to be some of the sweatiest players in your lobby. They keep up to date with all of the latest tryhard trends and probably use skins like Siren and Travis Scott every single day. These players will also grind out Arena and have probably already reached champ Champions division in the brand new Fortnite season. They will follow a lot of pros as well. Their favorite pros to watch are definitely going to be Clicks and Benji Fishy, and Benji Fishy is where they got the inspiration for the Leviathan Axe. These players don't buy items depending on whether they look good or not. They kind of wait a few weeks to see if it is tryhard or not, and when it is tryhard, that is when they decide to buy it. Coming in at the number four position, we have the Phantasmic Pulse. If you guys use the Phantasmic Phantasmic Pulse, then you love the customization offered by this pickaxe. To top this pickaxe off, it is a single-handed pickaxe as well, and you just want to stand out as much as you can. This is also considered a sweaty pickaxe as well, so a lot of the sweats out there have been using this a lot. Ever since these superhero skins did have some changes though, this pickaxe has really dropped off, and I'm sure a lot of these players have changed up which pickaxe they are using. Hopefully Fortnite do add some more customization pickaxes like this in the future. I would really love to see a similar design for even the standard pickaxe in Fortnite. That would be so, so sick and definitely one of the most popular pickaxes in the game. Coming in at the number three position, we have the street sign. The street sign is one of the weirder pickaxes that has ever featured in one of my videos. And there really aren't too many people out there that use this pickaxe, but the ones that do are very, very sweaty and love to stand out. It doesn't matter how expensive some items cost, as long as they look very sweaty and have a lot of bright colors. That is how they look sweaty, and that is how they are different to a lot of other sweats in the game as well. Most players that are known as the standout sweats are going to use skins like the Blueprint Wildcat and the Party Style skins as well with this pickaxe to get the ultimate glow. Low key though, this is a really amazing pickaxe and definitely something I will buy when it does return to the store. Moving on to the number 2 position, we have the Axtral Form. If you guys use the Axtral Form pickaxe and you are a Battle Pass sweat, Battle Pass sweats make sweaty combos by using Battle Pass items only, and the Axtral Form is one of the sweatiest Battle Pass pickaxes that has been added to the game. It is also brand new and part of the Season 6 Battle Pass, so it is very popular in Fortnite at the moment. I can definitely see a lot of pros and content creators using this pickaxe as the season goes on. It's going to work well with a lot of tryhard skins, and I cannot wait to see people using this with skins like Siren, 
Dark Bomber and the Aura Skin as well. Obviously, to be a Battle Pass Sweat, you don't have to use this pickaxe. There have been a lot of sweaty pickaxes in the past, and I'm only putting in the actual form because it is the most recent sweaty Battle Pass pickaxe. But finally, guys, coming in at the number one position, we have the Harley Hitter. The Harley Hitter means you are one of two different types of players. The first one means you are going to be a fanboy of all of the collabs in Fortnite, whether that is Marvel, DC, Star Wars, all of the icon skins, or any other collabs that have been added to the game. And these players don't really care whether the items are try hard or not, as long as they are from their favorite collabs. But the second type of players that use this pickaxe are known as the sweats. There isn't really too much else I can say, but if you come across someone using the Harley Hitter pickaxe, more often than not, they are going to be very sweaty at Fortnite. They are going to know every single bit of peace control, every retake in the game, and probably have a lot of earnings as well. These are going to be some of the best players in Fortnite, and especially with Mr. Savage using this pickaxe every single day, this is going to stay very, very tryhard for a very long time. But there you guys go. That is my list for what your Fortnite pickaxe says about you. Again, this wasn't really in any kind of order. It doesn't matter where your pickaxe came in, as long as it did feature on this list. But thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to go down and hit that subscribe button. We are on the road to 200,000 subscribers. Hit that like button as well. Let's try and reach 3,000 likes on this video and leave a comment with your favorite pickaxe in the game. Thank you guys so much for watching. Click one of the videos on your screen now and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.